so guys on today's video i'm going to share with you what i have learned living life in the off grid of kenya and why i live here on the other video i talked about if i regret living in the countryside and yeah today i want to share with you what i've learned so I'll start with the strongest and biggest thing that I've learned while living in the village for the past four years now. And that is appealing to me. And that which is appealing to me mostly is the financial aspect of it can save a lot of can save a lot on utility bills like unlike living in the ville in the city if you want to cook and you don't have money to buy the gas you can fetch firewood and cook with it or if you don't have water you can go to the stream the water is very clear, very fresh, and it's very nice, guys. And also, you can fetch rainwater. You can use it for cooking, washing, and there are no bills there. Doing this, there are no water bills either because you can store your rainwater. And when it comes to electricity, you can also use the solar power if you don't want bills you can buy the solar power instead of the electricity and most people don't earn and they can afford the solar power so that is quite cheap you won't have the monthly electricity bills or water bills so mostly here it rains and the power goes off most of the time. It can even uh, stay up to three months or one week. So it's better you you have the solar power. That will save you a lot of money, a lot of time, a lot of everything. Second thing that I have learned here in the countryside is the lifestyle itself is work and that is good because after working for someone for so long so that I can pay my bills it uh, you lose you use a lot of energy because you work for someone but here I I don't want to I've learned not to rely on someone but myself for the most part of it cuz I mean working by for myself uh, is really refreshing cuz everything you do here at the homestead is directly related to my life or your life if you are the one who is living here most of people can relate to those people who live in the countryside for example if i want to use the firewood as a, i love to put or collect some firewood to so that i can cook for myself which is so satisfying guys because you're going to get the pay off for yourself that is being in control of your energy so guys yeah that's what i've learned because that is i don't you don't have to rely on someone else big reason that i'm going to share with health aspect of it like you can grow your own food from the garden you can get it from your own garden and also when it comes to meat you can even get from the chicken that you're rearing mostly people don't slaughter cows in their homestead but you can get fresh meat and 
from the slaughterhouse because choose to live here in the countryside life is really awesome guys if you really want to start uh, living here you can start your own homestead journey and guys don't get worried of what other people will say like for me i wanted to relocate back to relocate before the pandemic but but most people were like will you be able to survive in the village will you be able to nini in the village why will you take your son to the to school and the people have wrong perspective of living in the village but before it was i was also scared but nowadays if you start living this journey it's really awesome very peaceful and calming and since i was the one who was suffering i didn't get worried of what other people or my peers were going to think about it and for living this way of choosing to come back here in the village and i really enjoy it here you can't spend your life worrying about what other people are going to think you got to do what best for you like i did what what was best for me that time and i don't regret it because guys the clock is ticking and it's really going very fast living here i don't have any regrets living this way cuz but it is what it is cuz what you want to do in life and you can't worry about people or what society is going to think about you and how many people do you know that are suffering from anxiety depression drug abuse and things that's happening nowadays and what's this why is that because nobody is really asking why all these mental breakdowns all i think is this is as a result of the society that we've created like we live in this stressful world like it's always on the go it was like that some few years back yeah. i was always on the go and enjoy life because life kind of passes you by and living this way here in the village it's really simple and has been really awesome for my mental health so stress free and peaceful it's like living a simple life and going at your own pace and you get to stop and enjoy things so yeah things you have to do in the homestead like gardening having nature walks like me i love nature walks to the stream and swim you can fetch water if you like you can also do a lot of things they are very satisfying guys and you feel a sense of accomplishment knowing that you are doing things that are worth worthwhile and directly related to your life like now i'm really at peace with myself and peace with everything that's surrounding me Because to tell you the truth when i was living in the city i came back in the village i was really depressed living here in the countryside but now i'm very okay living here i've experienced a really peaceful life last but not least this lifestyle is simple the big thing is getting land if you don't have land like most people here like where i'm living here in the countryside this is an inheritance from my father's side here yeah, guys so if you want to buy land you can buy it's easier and quick also when i'm here you can hear someone is selling land most people sell land here around january because 
some have kids that are going to university some need uh, to do something with the money so they sell their land and do something that is wiser with it so the land the possibilities guys are endless like me i think endless thank you so much and have a lovely and blessed weekend